After the game against Toronto, Wilson, after you hit the shot, that um, I didn't see the same joy either from you or your teammates after that game. Is it because, are you guys a little drained right now, or is it just because of the way the game was going? I don't think so. Yeah, I hit six of them. Everybody's kind of used to it. <laughs> it's as simple as that, though, because. I think so. Are you guys feeling in a pretty good space right now? Are you feeling that the weight of trying to get things correct and it's not quite happening where you want it to? I don't think so. I think everybody's kind of you know, gearing up, just getting ready, just trying to lock in a little bit. Ability really does. Phoenix is 24-8 at home this year. What makes them so good at home? What do you guys have to do to come out with a win tomorrow? Uh, well, the crowd gets behind them. to get They generate a lot of energy from that, and they shoot the ball very well at home. You excited to be back playing a Western team after five, I think it was, against the U.S.? Maybe a familiarity breeds contempt? Yeah, maybe. I mean, you know, we're used to playing Western Conference teams, obviously, a lot more. You know, we've seen them a great deal, no especially one. Phoenix. You know, you know so it's messing you. With you liking the effort against Orlando, even though it was a loss, and then you being disappointed for the, with the game against Toronto, even though it's a win, do you... Hold it to be a bigger priority for the team's development more than wins and losses at this point? Yeah, well, you, you just want to continue to, to get better. That's the key. You, know, you obviously want to continue to put W's in the column. That's equally important, but you also want to continue to get better. Do you see this as just a bad patch for you guys? Or is it yeah. Nothing to worry about? You guys can worry all you want to. I really don't care less. <laughs> you know, we, we just have to focus on what we do and continue to get better. Drew said uh, after the Toronto game they thought you guys might be tightening up a little bit just in anticipation of what's coming and also just not really being in this place before of not really playing well. Is that something you're sensing at all? Like guys maybe just playing Could be. There? Could be. I, I, I don't know. I mean, it's the first time. Um, most of the guys on the team have had to defend the championship. So it might be. Eight of your next ten are on the road. What do you guys have to do to be successful down that stretch? Win. <laughs> hey, Cole, Phil talked about how um, important it was going to be for the bench to even step up playing Phoenix again. So it's basically, it's all around contribution. Huh? Yeah, you know, the guys will be ready to go. You know, they know what they need to do. You know, we know what we need to do. So we just got to go out there and do it. Lamar's comments after the game the other night basically guys have sort of given away that aura that you have made teams believe that they can beat you. Would you? You guys think you sort of let teams get more confident against you than you should? Uh, I think you know, teams gain confidence. You know, they see us struggling, they obviously gain more confidence in terms of you know, how to be able to beat us, things like that. So, But it is what it is. It doesn't matter. You know, it does have a, a practical impact on how games go one way or the other. Well, I mean, the you know, when the playoffs come around and you're playing well, you know, you um, take that confidence from your opponent as the series goes on. That's the most important thing. When the playoffs come around, you know, we're rolling.